Everything we believe In this video, I'm going to talk to you guys about how to get more views and subs for your channel. Now, first of all, you have to create your channel. Also, uh, uh, YouTube has a new thing. Instead of you have to have a thousand views to get um, monetization, you have to have 10,000 lifetime views. Not sure how when they changed that, but I noticed that earlier today that they did. I was, I was looking at, apparently I have a community strike and they took down one of my videos, which is ridiculous. I'm trying to say it was inappropriate, but that's not the point of this video. I think it's absolutely ridiculous. But before I actually jump into this video, I need you guys to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Check out the description below into that giveaway. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. I put a lot of effort into my videos. And anyways, let's get into this. Now, for the first tip, you need to have a very enticing thumbnail. You need to make it where it looks professional because most of your views, half of my views do come from mobile devices and on a small screen you're going to make sure you want, it looks nice and it kind of gets to the point. Uh, lately I've been working on my thumbnails where it looks more professional. You like it, want, you want it to pop out. Most of the time you're going to have that cool little bubble kind of text. Don't go for really complicated weird looking text because no one's really going to, you know, no one's going to want to click on that. You know what I mean? Like, think about it this way. Are you going to click on your own thumbnail? Does it look like a thumbnail you click on? Personally, some of my videos, I would not click on it. I wouldn't even touch it. I'd just skip right past it. But some of the ones lately, I would click on it, and I'm proud of what I did, have made. Um, now, my second tip is the title. Se second thing they're going to look at is the title. You're going to have, you got to have kind of like a clickbait, kind of like clickbait, kind of a clickbait kind of like title and thumbnail but don't make it actual clickbait because you can't get your video taken down from that because someone can report it and saying it's not what it's supposed to be because it goes against youtube's no policies make it where it's it's like clickbait but it's really not it it's where the video actually is what the title says it is just don't fake it you know what i mean i, I believe you guys are getting what i'm trying to say um T uh, t tip three tags tags is one of the most important things for youtube you have to have good keyword tags um this extent chrome extension that i use on like a regular basis is called tubebuddy and i will put a link in the description for you guys now tubebuddy you can look at other people's videos and your videos and see what how many views per hour you're getting or you can also look at ranking keywords for that kind of video like Whenever I, ma whenever I make a video, before I even make it public, I look up the same name for my video and I see the top three videos for it and I look at their tags and I find what tags are the best because it has it numbered and I use those tags in my videos. I also will comment the tags because it also helps raise aware, like uh, in, the, in the rankings, the rate makes it higher. I will also... Don't also another thing. If you put your name in your description, you more of your videos will pop in the recommended other and compared to other people's videos, which is really helpful and helps a lot for views and subscribers. Don't forget to ask for subscribers. That also helps too. Now, uh, tip four: create playlists. And if you create a playlist, like I have, a, I have a stupid amount of playlists. Now, it, when you create a playlist, it will. Like the person, if they don't want to like sit there and search for your videos, they can find a playlist and they can continue from that playlist from like like let's say you have a series like I have our last series and they want to find out what video that they were on it will go back to it on that video also people can add their playlist to theirs they can also like um, save your playlist to their account and they can come back to it and you'll still gain views from that and they can also share it too which you can gain views and subscribers from now what I want you guys to do is to comment below what your channel is what it's about I also want you guys to go find three to five other channels similar to yours, similar um, sub size and content size. If you can't find similar sub size, just find the same content. Go into theirs, comment what your channel's about, and ask them to either give you a shout out or if you guys can collab. I'm personally looking for people to collab, but that's not the point. You comment on theirs, and hopefully, and the point is not to compete with each other. You guys need to help each other out. Like put their channel name in your description or use in the new things uh, the cards where it pops up in the corner of the screen which is actually is pretty cool and it's actually really nice if you guys do that and also if you guys want to collab I will also be looking at comments below and I will give you guys shout outs as well if you guys really want one in my upcoming videos I will put in the cards I already put in the description depending upon which one you guys want you guys just gotta let me know and I, I believe 
I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope these tips can help you grow your channel. I personally know that TubeBuddy does help you grow. I don't use the pay version because I don't want to pay for it. It's kind of, I don't have, I don't make enough money from my normal job to actually do that. So yeah, there's that. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. Don't forget to check out my other videos. I have Photoshop and SoundCloud videos. So go check those out. I have also have other how-to videos. Hope you guys enjoy my channel. Hope you guys enjoy all my daily uploads. I upload lots of stupid stuff. And don't forget to like, share, and uh, like, share, subscribe. Also, turn on post notifications. And if you do that, then you and you tweet to me a screenshot of it and comment below. You guys can be part of my post notification squad. So hope you guys do that. Peace out, guys. See you guys next one. Yeah.